Lorient have yet to beat any of the three promoted sides this season, but hope to do so as they welcome Tour to Stade de Moustoir. With Rennes, Nice and Bordeaux all in action on Sunday, a win would see them temporarily up to fourth place. Time is running out for Trois meanwhile, who remain mired in the relegation zone, six points from safety. Though they have been praised for their style of play in recent weeks, they simply haven't been picking up points. Lorient took the lead in the 20th minute as Jeremy Aliadier squared for Kevin Monepake, who just about managed to get the ball over the line. Referee Omari Dillaru awarding the goal with the help of his assistant. Some lovely build-up play from Lorient here, and though Monepake did his best not to score, the ball was adjudged to have crossed the line. As you can see, there wasn't much in it. Seen again from another angle here, the ball appears to be furthest to over the line just before Jeremy Breche clears. Either way, Manu Pake with his third goal of the season. There was no doubt about Lorient's second goal, however. After a fine exchange of passes, Manu Pake slipped left for Maxim Bartelme. His excellent cross was then volleyed home from close range by Enzo Real. The 21-year-old, who got this move going 10 passes or so earlier, firing home his first goal in Ligue 1. A superb strike. Bartelme with his second assist of the season. Lorient with a 2-0 lead heading into the second half. Well, Troyes coach Jean-Marc Ferland had little to get excited about in the first half, but his side did pull a goal back in the 66th minute, as Breche got his head to a Stefan Darbion corner. Fabian Odar looking unimpressed, and there was frankly very little he could do to stop this one. Breche with his first goal since the 17th of April 2010. Seven minutes from time, Lorient restored their two-goal lead as Real curled in a free kick and Gregory Bourillon rose to head it home. Bourillon with his second of the season. But Lorient continued to look fragile defensively and conceded a second goal two minutes from time. Julien Fossurier crossed in for Fabien Camus, who got past Lamine Gassama and slotted past the dart for 3-2. An excellent finish from Camus for his fourth goal of the season. 3-2 was the final score. Lorient making life a little hard for themselves, claiming a horrible win in Christian Gorkiv's words, but coming away with the three points. Trois, meanwhile, edged that little bit closer to League Two.